Welcome. This video will show you how to borrow books from other Mass Library networks using your sales library card. Before we begin, here's a quick overview of our network, the sales library network, and the other Mass Library networks. Our network is comprised of 72 different libraries and branches in 40 communities within southeastern Massachusetts. Other networks in Massachusetts include the Clams Network, which is down here on the Cape, and we're going to be borrowing a book from that network in this video, the Old Colony Network on the South Shore, the Metro Boston Library Network, Noble, and the Merrimack Valley Library Consortium in the northeastern corner of the state, the Minuteman Network for the Metro West area, and CW Mars for the libraries in central and western Massachusetts. Let's say that we were looking for the latest book in the Stephanie Plum series by Janet Ivanovich. It's called Twisted 26. So let's go up to the top of the search bar and let's look for it. And it comes right up, but wait a second. The ebook says there's an eight week wait for it and the audiobook says it's an eight week for that book as well. But wait, why don't we try to see if it's in another mass library network? So let's try the nearby Clams Network. The library is on Cape Cod to see if it's available. So what we're going to do to start looking for the Clams Network is we're going to click on the Libby head all the way in the top right corner of your screen. So you can click on it and underneath your libraries, the third selection down, we're gonna click on add a library. From here, we can type in the name of any library network. So let's try Clams, just like I said before. And there it is, Clams comes right up. And you know it's Clams because it says Hyannis, that's down the Cape, right? And what should happen is it brings us right to the Clams page. But keep in mind, this only brings us to the catalog page. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the search bar above and it saves our Twisted 26 search, so we can just click on that, and sure enough, check it out. We can actually borrow the ebook or the audiobook if we want to. What we're going to do next is click on Borrow for the ebook. And once we do this, it'll prompt you for three options. What we want to do is click on the second option. I'm visiting from another library. So we can use our sales card to take out the book digitally. Go ahead and pause the video so you can actually take out your library card because you're going to need that information on the next screen. When you're ready, we can click on I'm visiting from another library. And at the, at the top, it'll you can click on Sales Library Network because we are Sales Library Patrons. And then down in the middle, we want to click on Sales Library Patrons again. And then from here, we can enter in our library card information. If you're not sure about your PIN number, keep in mind that it could be the last four numbers of the primary phone number on your account, which could be a cell phone number or the last four numbers of your home phone number. If you're having trouble with this or you're getting lost in the process of borrowing books from other library networks, you can always call the Wareham Free Library Circulation Desk at 508-295-2343 and dial zero. Once you've entered in your library card information, you can officially borrow the book. Keep in mind, you can actually select up top how many days you're borrowing the book for. So select, select 21, and once we click on borrow, we've officially borrowed the book. One of the other things we can do is we can actually now click on the Libby head up top, and we can switch back and forth between clams and sales and borrow books interchangeably from both networks. So if we go back up to the Libby head and go back down to add a library, what we can do is we can type in a name of any one of these other library networks. So let's try CW Mars. Just typing it in. And sure enough, it comes right up. Check it out. We know it's central western Massachusetts because the address it gives us is Worcester. And we can click there 
and begin searching the CW Mars catalog. Just make sure that you have your sales library card handy if you're going to borrow books from another network. When you're borrowing ebooks and audiobooks from other mass library networks, there are a few things to keep in mind. First, library patrons of the network that you're borrowing from have first preference on held items, so a book with a long wait time might take a little longer to get to you. Number two, you are free to search for books at other mass library networks, but the device and the app will only save cards for library networks that you've borrowed a book from. And lastly, be aware that checkout days are different depending on the network. For example, the Boston Public Library and the Old Colony Network limit is 14 days, but for CLAMS and other networks, it's 21 days. Thank you for taking the time to view this video. If you're having trouble trying to use Libby on your device or from your computer at home, you can always call a circulation desk at 508-295-2343 and dial zero. Also be sure to check out our other Libby videos.